What's up, everybody? This is Bruce, aka Geektacular, and today I've got another unboxing for you. Um, today I'm going to be unboxing the brand new DVD release of um, In Hyphen's Memories Step 2. So, um, for those of you who aren't aware, um, B Lift and Big Hit and all those associated companies actually put out a um, semi, mostly annual um, DVD release. And now digital release um, that has uh, basically sort of an overview of the past approximately year or so, one to two years, um, including tons of behind the scenes videos, live performances, sometimes full concerts even or full online shows if they've done any of those. Um, all so much behind the scenes video and making of music videos and award shows and all kinds of stuff. Um, it's basically sort of just like a retrospective of a certain period of time um, in the group's life. So uh, they, they do this for BTS, Tomorrow by Together, you know, all that good stuff, and also in Hyphen. Um, this new one that just came out is actually the newest one. It covers 2021 through 2022. And just so you can kind of see it in comparison here, this is memory step one. So this was the one that covers everything from 2020, basically their debut through 2021. So this is kind of the first um, one to two years of their um, existence here. And this is kind of what it looks like. As you can see, they've kept basically the same sort of like basic look for it. Um, and that it's got sort of the small sort of Polaroid photo in the middle. Then the band with some info on it here. And then, you know, uh, roughly the same dimensions and shape. They don't, they don't fit exactly, but they look very similar. Um, so it's got its own look, but they do sort of keep the same kind of general uh, look and feel there. So I'm going to open this up and show you everything that's in here. I just wanted to kind of compare it there. So in case you do have step one, you can see sort of how it looks besides step two. Um, but before I do that, I'm just going to show you the Weavers um, pre-order bonus. So if you pre-order this directly from um, B-Lift on Weavers, you uh, would receive this. And this is basically just, I think, a sticker sheet. I think these are all stickers. So um, there's one sticker for each member. In, um, in a cool little sticker sheet there. So nothing too crazy, nothing too insane, but yeah, just kind of um, some exclusive stickers there if you pre-order it from Weavers, like I do most things these days. Um, so yeah, there's no, doesn't look like there's any stickers or anything on the outside. All these stickers, I believe, are actually on the box. So I don't, yeah, I don't think there's anything on the shrink wrap on the outside. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it up. And we will take a look. So this does come in two different versions, two different kind of varieties. They have slightly different color schemes and stuff like that, but um, the actual main contents should be the same. Um, there is a digital version, so you still get a big box. You still get the photo book and all that good stuff. Um, it's got a slightly different color scheme. Um, and that one... I believe has digital codes, digital codes for weavers that will unlock basically digital version of all the same stuff. Um, I went with the DVD version, so that's the one you're going to be seeing here. So this one has all the same content, all the same photo books and all that stuff, photo cards, um, but all the video content just comes on DVDs that are actually in the box here instead of just uh, digital codes. So you can pick whichever one you like. You'll get the same, um, the same basic uh, content either way. Um, I just prefer this so I can sort of have it all locally. I don't have to rely on Weavers or, you know, if I trade it or you know, sell it or something at some point, it actually has the stuff in here because the digital codes are not transferable. So once you unlock them once on your account, um, then that's pretty much it. Or if for some reason I lost access to my Weavers account or something like that, um, I can still have these on DVD. So I kind of prefer physical media, but that's just me. I'm kind of old school. <laughs> um, so let me just give you a closer look here. 
So it's basically, it's got kind of that sort of like matte rubberized sort of texture there um, that feels pretty premium. Um, it's sort of like an eggshell white color. It's kind of hard to see on the camera, but it's sort of like a, like an, like a cream white sort of color. And then all the reds are a little bit darker. They're almost like maroon colored almost. And all the text that's printed here, as you can see when I run the light over it, it's like glossy as is the photo that's on the front. It is just printed on the front here, um, but it is actually like glossy. Turn off the brightness here so you can see it a little bit better. So there's the photo there. And again, sort of, it basically is meant to look, kind of look like a little Polaroid photo or something. Everybody's name right there. And this is just kind of a paper, so a, a thick paper like strip that's on there. It sort of holds it shut. So when we look inside, I'll pull this off. But yeah, kind of like a dark red strip here with engine 2021 to 2022. And then let's see. It's always hard to tell exactly where the strip is like supposed to be. I guess it's in the right spot right there. Um, and then I'll show you the side without the strip in a second here. But it has basically the same stuff on the side. This one lists it as a DVD right there. And then here is the back. So there's your Comca sticker. If you don't know, you can shine a flashlight on this or like the camera light from your phone. And if you shine it at the right angle, you'll see a little holographic um, music note that sort of kind of looks like it like is floating off the sticker. And that's how you know that it's legit. Um, Hybe also has their own little uh, holographic sticker thing there, just so you can make sure it's authentic. This does appear to be all region DVD, which is awesome. Um, well, actually, this says all, but this one, this actual region code part says one in three. So it looks like it maybe doesn't work in region two. It is widescreen, NTSC, comes in Korean, English, and Chinese subtitles. It's about 300 minutes total with digital stereo for the audio. So pretty standard for um, big hit DVD releases here. I can like hear stuff falling around in this box. I'm getting kind of nervous, but um, let me go ahead and... The only problem with these little strips is that they're sometimes, they're really tight. So they're sometimes really hard to get on or off. So just be very careful when you're taking it on or off, but it just slips right off the bottom there. It is very tight. So yeah, just a little flexible uh, paper strip that kind of keeps it closed there. So this is what it looks like without the strip, like this, like that. So the strip probably goes like right below this in hyphen. It was probably sitting a little bit high uh, in the shipping box. So when I put it back on, I'll probably put it so that it kind of like stops about right there. I think that's probably about the right spot. But again, here is the back. And this is like, this is like a hard box, but it doesn't keep itself shut. So just be careful when you're holding it that you hold it shut if you don't have the little strip on it because there's no magnet or anything it literally just kind of like sits open like this so just be careful once you take this off that you don't turn it upside down and all this stuff flies out <laughs> um so let's see here what do we have here we'll just start at the top so this appears to be where the dvds are because i can see one is kind of loose in there <laughs> um but again all this stuff looks like it has the same sort of like cream off white with the dark red text kind of uh, scheme here. And this is just sort of a thin little um, glossy disc holder here. All my discs are loose, it seems like. So yeah, these discs are just in here and they're just sitting these little, these little um, slips here. So let me go ahead and just put these back in there. And then I'll show you. This one's trying to escape, like, into the package. <laughs> the, I really kind of don't like the disc holders in these because they're kind of, like, too deep or something. I don't know. But uh, that's okay. So this is kind of the sort of the meat and potatoes here. Other than the um, photo book, which is really cool, this is sort of the main part. Um, this is where all the videos and stuff are. So there's three DVDs, as you can see here. The first one has like the um, off-white disc label with maroon. 
This one is just like straight white. So it is a slightly different color. It's kind of hard to tell. But instead of being kind of like that creamy white, it's just like flat, just straight up white. And this one's sort of reverse, sort of inverse. So like kind of dark red with white text. Um, and then here are all of the um, features for each disc. First one, you get InConnect Companion. Um, all the background stuff, all the behind the scenes stuff for that. And then um, behind the scenes stuff for the 2022 Weavers Con. Then disc two is all about the uh, manifesto. Um, manifesto day one album and everything that goes along with that. So jacket shoot sketches, movie, uh, music video sketches. Um, the uh, taking some photos for their anniversary. And then this has a bunch of award shows they were on and things like that. Sort of behind the scenes of those. And then disc three basically has a ton of behind the scenes stuff about their um, manifesto world tour that just happened, which is cool. That was not that long ago, so I'm really glad they were able to, to include that on here. Um, so just a lot of behind the scenes stuff from different, um, different dates on that tour, it looks like. So yeah, that is um, that is the actual DVD holder itself and all those discs. Um, this is a really big uh, photo book here. So that's a, those are the two things that are in this box. There's nothing else in here. Um, I will probably actually go ahead and just put my Weavers pre-order in here as well. Um, but yeah, other than... There's just the DVD holder. And I guess if you get the digital one, I think it comes in kind of an envelope or sort of a similar thing, but it has digital codes in it. And then here, oh, here, here is one more thing that's under the photo book. I think this is a poster. That is a really cool poster. I like that. With like a arcade controller right there. An arcade pad. So no, that's super cool. I like that a lot. That's what's on the back there. So yeah, this is just a little kind of mini poster there. And then I think the photo cards and stuff are inside. They're kind of stuck inside of this book here. So let's take a look at those. Looks like we have a Jungwon, um, just standard photo card here. Very cool. And then we have this cool little like photo strip. Thing. So it's got kind of like a photo, like a printed photo sort of texture to it. Um, and then there's one picture uh, of each member there, as you can see. And it kind of has like a little back that sort of looks like a film strip with everybody's names on it. So yeah, that's a cool, that's a really cool little extra there. I like those. So you can keep those right in there. And then I think, let me just flip through. I think that's all that's in. Sometimes they put photo cards and stuff in other spots. But yeah, I think that's all that's in there. So the rest of it is this gigantic photo book. And I, when I say gigantic, I mean like it's enormous. I don't know. Uh, <clears throat> I'm not sure it has a page number here. I don't know. It is, well, I guess it's, it has page numbers, but for sort of the uh, individual sections. So yeah, it's about 250 pages, I think, because I think this is the last section, and it goes through page 241. And then there's a couple sections after, there's a couple pages after that as well. So it's almost 250 pages. Um, and these are like really thick, high quality, full color pages too. So I won't show you every photo in here because I want you to be a little bit surprised, you know, if you pick this up. But basically, I just want to kind of show you the layout and some examples. But it has different sections. Like this is all the stuff about Manifesto Day 1. And then it has kind of different sections of this section. So this table of contents kind of just tells you the next 40-some pages. So these are all behind-the-scenes photos, concept photos. Most of the stuff in here tends to kind of be like behind the scenes stuff. So it's usually not like the official photos, but sometimes it sometimes it's ones that they like didn't use, but they still took. 
Um, some of them are like candid photos of them actually like at the photo shoot, making the music videos, doing press conferences, award shows, all that good stuff. So just kind of showing you here the vast array of things you can expect if you pick this up. Um, yeah, super. some of them are like two-page spreads like that. Some of them are individual, group shots. It's all really like scattered in there. But they do separate it sort of by um, topic. Like this is them in the in the rehearsal space, like practicing and stuff like that. This is them hanging out outside. And then a bunch of pictures of them at their uh, at their world tour, various points, on stage, behind the scenes, all that good stuff different award shows and things like that over the course of 20 was it 2021 through 2022 so yeah that's basically it at the end um they get some uh some thanks and stuff like that that are kind of look like they're handwritten which is really cool just them goofing off hanging out stuff like that so yeah this is super cool um, I like that a lot. Very similar sorts of content to step one. This is just the, the newest one that updates the story there. But yeah, um, I just wanted to kind of show you what this included in case you were thinking of picking it up. Um, like I said, it does come in a digital format if you don't like that it is, uh, is on DVD or something. It does come with similar stuff, similar photo books and photo cards and stuff, but just in um, just in digital form if you want to watch it on Weverse instead. Um, so yeah, you get all that stuff that I showed you, and then, then it comes in here, and then you hold it closed, kind of like step one, how it had like the flexible um, band. This one is just kind of a paper sort of band here that you can put on like so. I think it probably goes about like right here probably because yeah that sort of covers uncover it's sort of covers up that and doesn't cover up the in hyphen on the back so yeah I think it probably goes somewhere about there if you're being exact with it but um yeah super cool love this a lot um definitely worth picking up if you're an in hyphen fan so Thanks everybody for watching. Uh, if you like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up down below. That would be awesome. Let me know in the comments if you like my Unhyphen unboxings. If you want to see me unbox basically every Unhyphen album and DVD release that they've had, um, I have a playlist on my channel where I have unboxings for virtually everything they've released um, because I own it all. So um, yeah, take a look at that. Uh, if you're an engine, let me know in the comments. And that will help me know that you guys want to see some more in hyphen content. Um, and if you just collect K-pop stuff, if you're into BTS, Murder by Together, well, Seraphim, and Team, and hyphen, anything like that. Um, or if you just collect DVDs, Blu-rays, I do a lot of videos about that kind of stuff as well. So if you're into any of that stuff, definitely hit the subscribe button so that way you don't miss any of my future content. So thanks so much for watching, everyone, and I'll catch you next time.